Okay. Mark the stampede here. Uh, continuing just some straight, some just tendering, just practicing banjo. Uh, I'm not exactly sure. I kind of like a combination of. I have a. You know, I mentioned before. I have like a ten-step process sort of combination of. Combination of it of a few stuff like the first step and some other steps. Um, first step and third step. I'm I'm still. I have a. Uh, I made a giant list of combos to learn, and I believe I have. And I've got one, two. Three, four, five, six, seven. I think actually eight more to learn. So. Um, let's just check this out. So I always, I'm trying to learn everything against uh, Roy because Roy is the middlest of the middleweights. Um, and also one of the most commonly used characters. So I figure he's a good character to practice all the combos on. And then, uh, just since he's right in the middle of middleweights, just trying to get the base of where he, of, where, uh, oh, trying, just trying to get the base of where things would be, rather. So... All right, so the first one, like I, I made a list of over 50 combos based on um, Frenzy Lights video, um, Eyes All Smashes video, and then a couple of J Play videos. And some of them, honestly, I think some of them like weren't true. Some of them didn't or were like just too hard to do, but then. But the, even just learn, doing something I've learned, I've found some more myself. Like if you do uh, falling near behind some, somebody, you can do toe down smash, even though that's not... Uh, and that's a confirm, even though it's not a true combo. It is a confirm if you... you basically, And it's also good because if you do it between... You can't do it at the... If you do the center state, it's not going to kill. If you do it too far... He'll fall, he'll fall off and you can't kill him. But um, if you do it like right here, for example. And then put up high enough. I don't even think that has to be that high. You do like, oh, I didn't do it right. You have to be able to jump. You have to do, do a rising, basically rallying behind him. No, I didn't do it the right way. All right, I'll, sh I could, anyway. So yeah, now like a little like if I go, oh, things in the way. Yeah, see, it's a, it's a, it is a confirm. It works. I think it works better on Final Destination without the platforms, but um, that's not meant to do. But anyway, or just like no. So like if you do this, that's the be that's the most damage. If you do the berry to the uh, like the double jump or the jump instant jump. Uh, I, I instant double jump or just a jump fair but if you do a short hop if you do a short hop fair it always it, it might do, it confirms less a lot lower but I think it's impossible to get out of if you do a short hop fair I don't I don't think there's I don't think they can DI out of it at all so once you get to the high once they get to the higher percentages just always do short hop fair because if you like for you have to you have to time up tilts you have to time forward jump fair or double jump fair um, though I think it doesn't kill until like I don't think it actually kills until it gets like one th that killed but I think um, with like sail moves on and stuff like that it probably won't kill till it might not kill till like 130 reliably and weights and stuff but uh just like they can di out of this they can di they can di out of up they can definitely di out of uh forward smash 
Like force natural will only works if they if they don't do any di, and then they can di out of, and then up tilt is just hard to do, right? It's just super hard. It's just really hard. And then um, yeah, and they can. I mean, if you jump and then start the fair on the way down, it's hard. Like it's hard to avoid, but it is it is possible. So anyway. But anyway, what I so what what I was looking at is so the, I have a few more to do. Uh, the first one is the first more first first one is just do a uh, a grenade throw to a fair. All right. Um, what's the what's the uh, starting percent that this works at? Ninety percent. So let's try that. Oh. I don't know how I got there. Oh, no, I don't want to say I don't want to say because I want to know when they start confirming. But no, okay, so 90%. But anyway, I'm going to try to, I'm going to work on these combos, see when, that was terrible. <laughs> well, I'm going to work on these combos, see when they start confirming, when they, uh, Stop confirming, and then kind of giving them a rating. That one is not too hard. Uh, then I feel like I'm giving these ratings, but I've been basically working on these multiple nights. So this feels easy now because I've been working on stupid uh, these these combos, the uh, Bregel Blaster comp confirms are feel like impossible. They're so hard because you do. Yeah, I always am doing that. I was trying to do the Regal Blaster combo. It's annoying. Should be like. Okay, I got that. Uh, so yeah, it's, it's just that's hard. So this feels easy. And it worked at. You try it like. Just want to try it like three times. Make sure it doesn't. That you can't di out of it. Right. Yeah. So okay, definitely confirms at 90 near the edge. Does it confirm at 80 near the edge? Yeah. That, all right. Let's try. See if it still confirm. See if it keeps confirming. That was way too long for me to do anything there. Um, anyway, let's keep trying here. Yeah, and I found the structure. I, I'm not really looking at the structure guy, but it is helpful, I believe. To me, at least it's helpful to me. It's still, okay, let's try one more time. It seems like it works pretty reliably, even at 80. All right, that, that, I messed that up. But anyway, there's the whole point is of try of trying to learn all these combos, which and then is that they there are ways to kill for your banjo to kill even without side B, bear, then the berry confirm, which is the most basic confirm, right? Banjo can banjo doesn't necessarily need those to kill. Try 70. I don't. That feels like that that point is not going to confirm. Didn't do anything right. Okay. Okay. Uh, a little bit closer to the edge. All right. Didn't do that right. Uh. Anyway. Okay, I don't think it was close enough to the edge, so let's try that one again. Oh man. I guess I should have another controller, but I don't feel like have messing with two controllers, so just move them around. Oh my gosh. 
All right, you're gonna be over here then. I feel like 70 was too low anyway. It's too far away. Now you're gonna be over there. All right, come on, man. That did kill, but it looked like he could DI out of it. Let's see if I, let's try again here. It really feels like he DI out of it. What's my DI on them? A lot, okay. He's underneath the platform. Man, messed up there. I set the grenade throw that time. Whoops. Go back to... That's the way to do it. I was too, he was too far away from the edge that time, so I'm not going to... Because usually I want him to at least this far below the edge below the ledge rather platform all right okay I let's see if 75 I think you remember 75 here too close I was too close for that to that right That definitely killed. I wonder if you DI out of it. Interesting. It doesn't seem like he's DIable. Let's try one more time. I'm just doing like three times in a row to like the different DIs, right? All right, it doesn't seem like it was possible to DI out of that at 75. Let's try 72. Terrible grenade throw there. DIable at 72. 73? Let's see. DIable at 73? Doesn't appear to be. Let's try two more times at 73. We might have found where it's DIable at. All right, one more time. I didn't even get the fair completely right that time. It still worked. Uh, I didn't hit the fair right. The fair was even worse that time is what I'm saying. All right, middle of the platform, 73%. Okay, 74, definitely diable. Voice recovery, not the greatest, but. All right, okay. Okay, didn't push him fast enough, huh? All right, let's see if 74 is a killer. All right, just terrible, terrible grenade, gren grenade all together. I need to work, so another thing I need to work on is grenade throws. Okay, mm, so we know 75 is undiable. Not sure about 73. I'm sure I need to work on this. That I'm sure about. I think everybody's sick of me doing this. I'm in my in my house, but. I feel like this is important to know, like when, like what combos I can do, what combos, and what when they start working. What's my problem here? All right. Okay. And so I don't want. Not that I don't, I don't think Brage actually takes it, takes an effect yet, but just terrible. Oh my gosh. Just want to make sure the rage doesn't affect anything. 
What is my problem today? All right, so we know 75 for 70. I mean, now 74. All right, let's try one more time for 74. The problem. Oh boy, this is not hard. I don't think this is like on a scale of the other combos, like I like the. Jeez, what's my problem here? Okay, so 74 is the first is where it starts confirming correct. So is where it starts for confirming, right? Um. So I'm putting a note that these are all confirmed, so I know for later. Okay. But anyway, like the whole idea is, I'm going to learn all the com all the combos that are true combos for Brent that, and then and then I can do and see what they what character what character what they how they affect it. the ones that work on the most the easiest to do and work on the most weight classes right those are the ones we want to work on um, and then and then the same thing with confirms I want to figure out when all the confirms start and just the kill moves too when the kill kill moves confirm start killing and which ones are I can do and just try to so I can base my game game plan and gameplay around that okay so this is this is just saying a drop B to uh, drop a drop B to oh okay I've done this one before this is similar to in their own platform Because, okay. So just saying, okay, alright. Like, you do this, you drop a grenade, and then you just wonder when they pop up. Oh, you have to get off the platform. <laughs> Keep getting stuck on the platforms. Can you not push them that way? You can only push them from behind? Alright, I guess I can do that. That's hard. It's harder than I thought. Maybe he didn't pop up high enough, because then... Oh, I didn't do it right. From this side? He needs to do like... No, that didn't work. You really have to hit him from... All right. He doesn't confirm till he's higher. Okay, that worked. I had to drop off the platform first. So like, then I got stuck on the other platform. Irritating. So you have to drop the egg like. This is hard. Do it through the platform. Hmm. Let me look at that combo again. I practiced it in the air before for a different combo, so let's look at this one again. How they do it in the video. Oh, short hop. It's like a short hop reverse, okay. Okay, so what they do is they drop the grenade and then they do a sh all right. They're also close to the middle of the platform. So that's like right here. Okay. It's pretty hard to get out of that, huh? 
Let's let's see if they full confirmed at 75%. Like right here. I wasn't far enough from the platform that time. That this is so situational. I mean, get get. I get. I mean, I. It's very situational, but it's good to know all the different situations, right? I'm not gonna kill yet. All right. So it's like right here. Too high. You really have to know. You really have to like time it correctly. Okay, so 75% works. All right, what about can we? How low can we go? Right, 65% is that gonna work? Sixty-five seems like they're not getting hit down far. They're not getting popped up high enough, even if you do a short hop and then you. So it's like I don't. Oh, that did work. So you're doing like. It's not really so much timing as you can still actually rea react to where they land, right? It's just you just have to pay attention. It's actually not as hard as I thought. Oh, we didn't rate the last one. What are we saying that last combo was? The, the thrown grenade to fair? Uh, is it harder than the landing there behind the opponent? Um, is it the same as down throw berry short hop fair at ledge? Uh, yeah, I guess it's about that. The thrown grenade to wondering on plat thrown gr uh, drop grenade off platform. Grenade off platform to wonder wing. Um, all right, let's try this one more time. If it's still, if I connect and it works, then we know that. It all right, so 65 still, is, it, is this gonna work at 55? Because if so, that would be insane. That would, this is why, if, that, if this works at 55, then uh, ban, ban Banjo. Jeez, that did work. That's insane. Can you DI out of it though? I mean, I don't think so, because I'm reacting to the DI. Oh my gosh, that's ins that's insane. That's so that's that is definitely OP. Oh my gosh, he even How low can you go? There's no way 45% will work. That would be insane. The other thing about the like the thing about I don't know. I, this is the first time I, I'm learning banjo. It's the first time I've got I've like I've learned combos for other characters, but the first time I've like really. Oh my gosh. That works at 45 percent. That doesn't make that makes no sense. That's just crazy. Oh my gosh, that worked. So you just have to you just have to wait on the you just have to wait till your fall matches the opponent's fall. Uh, that. Then I guess you have to press the button. You can do that too. <laughs> but anyway, so uh, this is the most I've ever like actually tried to learn the combos. I mean, I have learned co like I did learn combos for Ness. I did learn combos for Rosalina, but like it's the first time I've labbed out like multiple combos, multiple confirm. Like I mean, not okay, not not entirely true. I did do that for other characters, but the first time I've on this in depth, I guess is what I'm saying. And try to learn the more nuanced care kills. Not, he's like not far enough away. I mean, I guess it's just like such a. I'm not. Pre I keep not pressing Wonder Wing. Oh, because <laughs> he has to be like this. Far yeah, like I don't know what who'd be standing at ledge there. Okay, again, not pressing the button. I don't know what was I saying. I don't remember at this point. What was I? What was I talking? What was I jabbering on about? Um. I 
I don't remember. What? Why am I? It's not that hard. Just press this, and then you go down, and then you press B. Oh, cause they don't. Oh, now I don't have Wonder Wing. All right. Well, that's good to know. Missed. All right. My fault. Okay, we know we confirmed it at least once. So if we can get confirmed three more time, two more times, then we know that it actually starts killing at 45, at 45 percent or lower, which is just bananas. Yeah, like pops up so it's so particular though like you have to he has to be like here or farther on the ledge and banjo has to be like around there all right but if it occurs one more time that means it definitely confirms at 45 percent that this is so though like i said this is so particular who's gonna be standing right there <laughs> Like, if you're sta just standing right there in my kill rank. I guess the, thing, the the part about learning all these different combos is, if you don't stay in that kill rank, and like, maybe you didn't, but then maybe I do that, maybe I do that other kill confirm that I was telling everyone about, where it goes, pops it up the wrong way, but anyway, like, you know what I say. You know what I mean. Get the grab, then the, not, I mean, if this works at 40%, this is, this is just totally busted. I can't imagine. Uh, yeah, it looks like that might be too, that might be too much. All right, hold on. I like this music. I haven't ever, uh, what? 40%? All right. Let's go crazy. Let's just try it. Does it cook? We'll confirm at 30%. Hmm. The Alex music reminds me of a uh, Chitty Chitty Bang Bang. Like I said, I've never played Banjo Kazooie, any of the Banjo Kazooie games. I'm going to do that this summer. Alright, so, okay, alright. 30% 30, 30 is ridiculous. 30% though, it wasn't working. Makes sense. That'd be crazy. It confirmed at 30 percent. That just that's just that just be nonsense. Oh, the really low on that. Really over. Got to remember the whole point is you wait until your to your height matches your opponent's height. Uh. I don't know. Looks like he might have been able to DI out of that. Let's try again, though. Maybe he couldn't. Okay. Got caught on the ledge there. It's alright. But anyway, I'm pretty sure my kids and my wife are sick of watching me just mess around with this. Uh, mess around with these combos, but I'm like, I'm like I'm trying to really learn all the different combos so I have a really good understanding of what to do. I caught on the left. Okay, I think that confirms at 30%. That's insane. Oh my gosh. Let's try 32%. So I guess I know what to do if I get a get an get a grenade confirm. Oh my gosh. I can see doing this on online quick play and that person just quitting. 30, 32%? Oh my god. If, it hap if this happened to me, I would quit. I would not play the I would just sell my Switch. If I was at 32% and somebody did this to me, I'd be like, you gotta be kidding me, man. Alright, does 33% work? Uh, it looks like it does. Okay, uh, he, I caught I caught the platform there, so that might not be. Oh my goodness, this isn't this is insane though. This is the most insane thing I've ever seen. All right, messed up that one. 
I think though this looks easier than the last combo I did, the last confirm, but I think it's actually harder. Because you can get, there's, you get stuck on the platforms. You have to, like, the actual thing is so particular, like, the spacing is so particular. Yeah. Alright, let's just try it over here for a second. Alright, never mind. Not doing great here. Oh man, whatever. Okay, let's move this guy over here. Okay. That hit that hit the platform. I feel like he doesn't get popped up high enough. He's below 33 34%. Yeah, I think 34 <laughs> Wouldn't you be so many if he was a little bit far? Like, who would be standing right there, though? That's a weird, that's such a weird place to stand. If for whatever reason you were standing not quite at the ledge, I guess, oh. Maybe this is, a, maybe, oh, you don't actually? Maybe this is the perfect thing to do when some, like, to put, get the end lag on somebody. Like, somebody's doing a, a go, doing a get up attack or a regular get up and then you just do oh man that's actually so you do like I don't know you do this crap and then when they go then you if you see them doing regular get ups you do this that is okay 33% it confirms so that's okay so that that's the point of this 32% slow works? Jeez. But if Banjo just like threw me off the stage at like zero and then I then <laughs> and I was at 32% and I did just a regular get up and then I got hit or get up attack. And I died. Oh man. I don't know what I would do. I mean, people have gotten the the Luigi and the Mario like zero to death on me, but this is like I don't I don't know how to describe it. This would be demoralizing. It's insane. Thirty-two percent still works. All right. 31%? Surely it's going to stop working. We saw 30% didn't work, right? Was that... Did we just not... Did I just not confirm it right? Just like right here, and then... It doesn't... That's insane. How much damage does just Wonder Wing do? 26. Okay. So if you put it all together, put the 26 and the 26 and then the 10 from the rear egg? The 12 from the rear egg? I don't know. You can make can make it back from that. All right. Can you make it back at 28? Messed that up. I thought we saw that it stopped working at 30. Let's see if it works at 30, 28. If not, we'll go back to up to 30, 30, and see what happens. No. All right. Yeah. You can. You can. Uh, though that's some. I didn't mean to do that, but that's something you can do all the time to. Uh, to Roy's, or you can just do this. And they're trying to recover. Uh, it sucks, man. It sucks to be. I think that I think the uh, edge guarding, the ledge gu and the ledge trapping, make this match hard for Roy. All right, but okay, so you, it has to be 31. It looks like though, before it starts killing. 
Oh, okay, so it is 32. Though, like, he can make it back. But, whatever. Oh my goodness. This is such a trick. Alright, let's see. And I wonder when it stops killing. Like, once the, once the rear egg stops, stops popping it, the grenade egg stops... Starts popping them up too high. Oh, this is insane. Thirty-two percent. This this is a kill confirm at thirty-two percent. That's like Kazi or Steve level crap. All right, so that kills at thirty-two percent. Jeez. When did it, okay? Well, when did it stop killing? Does it stop po start popping them up too high at like eighty-five percent, for example, for you to actually do it? Excuse me. No. Like, what if we put them up to like a hundred and fifty or hundred thirty-six? Does that make it too? Does that make it too? Okay, that actually, I think it's he's popping out now. Hundred thirty-six. You're not. Or maybe if I do a double jump instead, it would still work. Yep. Okay. Uh, but I wonder, does he always go up, get popped up where you can do a double jump and kill? Ah, oh, well. Is there some point where he gets latched up too high? Is what I'm, is what I'm thinking. Alright, let's see. So if I put him up to like one... Uh, 60? 5? Does he then getting starting getting popped up too hard? No? That's insane. Oh, I think I remember what I was saying. I was saying, like, the Banjo conf combos and confirms are much like... They're much more finicky, and they rely on timing a lot more. Alright, I feel like uh, he's starting to even fall out of the double jump. So, like, if you go to, like, 180, 190. I bet he was gonna get too high with the double jump. But 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 they go there like they they have a starting like like all it seems like all the banjo combos that I've that I've tried out they have a starting percent, but no ending percent. So like if something works, it'll keep working. Uh, so that's that's insane. Like, if this confirm always confirms. Alright, that's... I feel like you could probably DI out of that. Alright. But at what, at this point, everything is confirmed. So who... Like, what... Like, do you, it wouldn't even matter. Yeah. Okay. So I'm just gonna say also infinite. I'm gonna give that a grade of four. That's much harder than the other ones. Uh, landing up... L up air to up tilt is the next one. Okay, let's look at this one. There's also a grenade to dare. That one's almost impossible to do. Um, okay, let's try this. Oh, hold on. What was that percentage they were starting at for? 115. Landing up air to up tilt on a platform kills. And I, I, I think there, like, there's like some overlap, but you have to do like, okay, you have to do like, all right. Hmm, how are they landing on them? My, my up air is hitting him too far. Uh, right on top of him. So, like... Just hitting... They're getting the... So, this is what's... A, what, this is what's annoying about... Kind of annoying about Banjo and Kazooie. So... 
uh, like the nares have multiple hits, the up air has multiple has two hits, and then based on how you space them or, and land them, they they put the your uh, they put the other guy the, your opponent in different ways, and they can uh, and then that affects what combos you can do. All right, so. Gotta jump right on top of them, basically. Like, literally, like, right on top of their head. And hit the last hit, I think. Yeah, it's hard. Keep getting... Doing the... Maybe I'm doing the... I mean, maybe start the up air sooner. Or later. Now later, it seems like you... Nope. Like maybe right on top of his head. Nope. Alright, let's try that. Let me see that again here. Just, it doesn't look like they're actually pulling out the up air till they're right on top of them. Till they're like on top of their head. Oh! Jeez. Was that a combo? I wasn't paying attention, I was trying to get the land the up air. It's like right on, you got, cause you were, not a combo. There's no combo meter, but I don't think it's escapable. You do. That's hard. It's super hard. So you have to do. You have to get, you want, so there's two hits of the, to the up air, one, and then there, there's one at the top and one at the bottom. So you're trying to hit only the bottom one, only only the one, the second hit. Okay, yeah, you gotta hit. This is super hard. I know um, I make the impossible look easy, but this is hard. I'm not waiting and not delaying it long enough. Okay, and then he's all right. Not okay. Does it work at a hundred percent? Is the question. This I think this is even harder than the other one. Jeez. Not, not, not delaying my up air enough. Still works 100%. Alright. Alright, so it's Does it work at, let's just say 85% for, as a brand, as an example, for example? Nope. Delay the up air until you're right in front. Nope, didn't, that was spaced out and too far, gotta be. Doesn't kill at 85%. Let's try 90%. Let's still kill at 90%. Didn't do that, right? Didn't do that, right? You gotta wait till you're already. It's like you have basically you're basically following through them, and then you're you're jumping on top of their head, falling. Oh man, I'm not getting this now. Nope. Missed it. Yeah. Hit it the wrong way. Didn't do it right. Just doesn't kill it there. Let's try tiny two. Didn't do it right. That was just a, that was just an up tilt. <laughs> Not what I was trying to do here. Hmm. Not delaying it enough. Space it too far away. You could do a turnaround up tilt there. Probably get the same confirm. Hmm. See how it gets. 
gets hit too far, he always gets behind you. Does it at 95? Does he always get hit in front of you? Okay, too early on the, or maybe not high enough on top of his head. Too early, I think. No, I don't think it has to do with. Okay. Don't believe this works. Okay. Just having trouble now. I'm just. The more you think about it, the harder, the harder it is to pull off. All right. So the problem is. Okay. When they land, you're basically. When is the up air coming out? Is my problem. Where. Jump right above their head, and then the up air comes out when you're right above their head. Yes, okay. That doesn't kill though, at 95% then. But definitely kills at 100, right? You're right above their head. Nope, I was not. Right above their head, like literally like about to footstool them. Right above their head. No. Nope, I wasn't right above their head. I wasn't right above their head. Ah, oh, jeez. Right above their head. Nope. possible if I just okay let's see right above their head too early okay and nope now too early now too early now nope too early now I think that was right but I think I spaced it too far away now, there we go. 97% does that kill? So you go now, nope, too early. Now, wrong, didn't space it right. Too early and didn't, sp and didn't space it right. Nope, too early and didn't space it right. Now, now. nope, too early. Now, wrong side. Now. The turnaround make doesn't makes it not work, I think. Alright, wrong too early. No. no, too late. Too late that I think. Too late or too early. Now, too early. Too space wrong. No. Space strong and too early. Too early. Now, nope. Right above their head, you put the start. Now, nope. Now, nope. Okay, let's slow this down again. All right. Okay, let's look here. You. Okay. So. Jump. Oh, it's like you go. Th it's like it's already through. You've already like fallen through. I see. Okay, you don't you don't actually start the up air until you've already fallen through the char other character. So you uh, you have to have fall you have to fall through right right on their head. 
Doesn't kill 97%. Doesn't kill 98%. Okay, that's that is super hard to do. So like you fall him through. Nine, so it does 98 per, does that kill 98? 99 rather? So it doesn't start killing till 99. Too early. So you basically you fall through and then you press up air. And it has to be like right on top of it, like right on the center of them. Because if you don't do it right in the center, then you get that. Okay. And then. Didn't do it right. So I'm right on top of them. Right on top of them, and then. Okay. Starts so killing at 99. It's good to know. Oh, uh, that's super hard. Uh, I'm gonna say that one's like a five. Five. I was doing a rating of um. We didn't stop killing. That's our. I don't think it ever stops killing, right? Because if you do. Oh, wait till he falls through. She gets easier, it looks like, because you, you mess up the spacing. Oh, yeah, it gets way easier the higher the percentage gets up. It starts playing at 95, but it's super precise. But after that, the, the higher the percentage goes up, it gets easier and easier. Okay. Let's look at uh, Briegel Blast. So, I have, what, how many? These aren't. Okay, uh, so, just trying to see if I should switch to what they're doing it on mostly on Final Destination. So let's switch to Final Destination. I don't know if I can. Let's figure this out here. Final Destination. Actually, let's do. I don't want to look at the Final Destination background or the banjo background. There are paints in the butt to look at. Uh, let's make. Um, yeah, let's do this one. Let's do Saffron City Final Destination. Oh yeah, Roof. I love Road to Varian City. This one. That's a bop right there. Okay. So again, I'll do Frankenstein. So neutral B to Briegel Blast to Rising Briegel Blast to Up Air is supposedly the easiest one to, to do. Let's see. Neutral B. Where's my camera at? Nope. Oh. Oh, you know what? You're going to start getting used to... I don't think it starts working until 56%, 46%. Um, shell moves off, and this will be on trajectory guide. Do I put that on? Let's try 46% here. All right, so. I need to practice, uh, so a few things I need to practice, uh, short hop, all right, that works. Um, short hop, Regal Blaster, uh, definitely. Short hop, oh yeah. Short hop, reverse area, like reverse, B reverse, B reverse, Regal Blaster. B 
B, I'm almost positive B reverse is faster to take out the B Regal Blaster than uh, Short Hop. Alright, so. That's what I meant to do. Okay, so let's see what they do. Do they do a Short Hop to start this combo? Short Hop, Regal Blaster, Regal Blaster. Short, basically, it's a Short Hop. It's a Short Hop. To fire the Briegel, to fire neutral B, then turn to Briegel Blaster, short hop, then Briegel Blaster, rising Briegel Blaster, then up, then a up air. So short hop, short hop, Briegel Blaster, rising Briegel Blaster, up air. Center stage. So short hop. This is hard. Er, than I would expect. Um, okay, this is the other problem. Okay. So, br rising Regal Blaster. Then you gotta. So you have to in mid air. You have to. You have to. Oh, jeez, this is annoying because. Uh, I have z using Z jump and then trying to cancel and then accidentally pressing R and while I'm press doing Briggle Blaster is doing the automatic reset. Uh, okay. So, short hop, raising Briggle Blaster, up air. Alright. Okay, so. I'm not getting the rising Briggle Blaster. Okay, I might call these ones a night. I also might not do these ones. These ones are hard and not that. And I get the point of them, but the the in air cancel is hard. This might be something I work on later. Cause I'm better at the mid air cancels. Yeah, I don't. Uh, it's too late for me to do that tonight. All right, so let's let's move that one down to too hard to do. Uh, I have a list of ones that are too hard to do. Then. Okay, then the next one, neutral air regal blast grenade. Okay, let's look at that one. Neutral air, neutral regal. Okay, then turn around grenade. I th that one shouldn't be that hard, right? Uh, it starts at. Zero? Oh, two B, uh, 25%? So basically, neutral B. Is it, are they just gonna stand there? I guess that would work. They just stand there? <laughs> so, alright, short hop. That's good damage. That's all right. Does that work at zero percent? I'm assuming. Short hop. They recover too quickly to get the grenade. I think at zero percent. Right? Is that the problem? I'd help if I did the grenade the right way. I think they can recover off of that. Uh, I don't think that's true in any. I don't think any of this is true, right? Is any of this true? So if I do, not that. What's the problem with the trying to do the reverse? Oh my gosh. All right, boy. All right, man. We can do this. Be too late. It might be too late at night. Uh, okay. So this is a comp. So this isn't a combo. That's just a setup. That's a, that's more like a, that's more of a. All right. So I don't think this is ever a combo, right? This this was ever a combo. Is it? Is it a combo at 25%? Uh, 
Uh, let's see. Let's look at this video. Hold on. Uh, I'm doing this right. Hold on a second. Sorry. Okay. Great. Uh, okay. One, two, three, four. Is that a combo? Two, three, four. Okay. I guess that's a combo. I didn't turn around. Uh, this is hard. It's hard because you have to turn around so quickly. Jeez, all right. Oh, I'm, when I'm trying to turn around, I'm do, I'm rolling. Okay, so I can't get the combo down. This is too hard. Oh my gosh. Alright, I'm can't uh it is a combo, it's not what I'm gonna bother with. I'm gonna I'm gonna use it as I am gonna use it as I'm gonna use it. But I'm gonna use it more as a tech chase or Um it's just getting going doing doing I need to work on the Briegel thing and the Briegel cancel in general. But just, I mean, that's a good way to rack up damage. But I'm not getting it. I mean, yeah, I especially keep doing messing up and yeah, I'm not gonna be doing. I don't want to mess up and waste the side B. I think all these remaining ones are the Briegel blast, the up tilt. That one might be worth it though. Um, there's just but there's a bunch of these that either aren't combos or are combos only in very specific instances, uh, or are just super hard. I don't even like I even stopped for most, most part. I did like when they did like when in the videos that say like beginner. I did all the beginners, intermediate or medium. I did like I at a certain point I stopped because they're getting too complicated or starting to be strings and not combos. I didn't bother with the advanced export pro things, but Briegel it's neutral B to a Briegel blast up to, I think this one is one that is good to know. Okay. But even these, even on this video, this is like the Briegel beginning to expert Briegel blaster combos by J play. It's like, these are hard. Okay. Hold on, it's like, did he even? Oh, let me just look at this. Rear egg. Okay. And then just a, a Briegel blast to up tilt. I think I understand the point of it, but do we want to do that? Starting at 30, starting at 36%. Don't you want to, don't, you don't want to, I mean, it works. It's not, I can't, uh, I'm not making it true. And I don't think I want to stale the, this. I want to be able to kill with it, right? Which, it, uh, I think we decided it kills at 80% here. Or fill out 100, definitely fill out 110%. So this is this is, I have this as a confirm. I I don't think I would use it at earlier percentages because I want to I want it to be a confirm. All right, so I'm gonna X out of that one. Uh, yeah, uh, and then this last one, then the other one, then it was just getting too complicated. All right. So uh, this whole video that I watched, I'm not doing anything from it, but it is good to. And then this, this is, I think this is, I think this in general is a crucial thing to learn as Banjo. Getting the spacing on this. And 
It doesn't actually matter how many times you hit him with the Breagle Blast. Once, one to three times, as long as you know when to get out the up tilt. I think that's the crucial part. But I think I have a pretty decent idea of the conf I mean, the actual combos are pretty hard to do, but I think I have a pretty decent idea of the confirms you, you want to work on. Um, like, grenade, right? Okay. Anyway, I'm not, I'm, anyway, the, the, easy, the easiest confirms just side B. Like forward smash, down smash at the ledge, side B. Uh, Barry to forward smash, up smash. Up tilt is super hard. It's hard to get. Um, but, and then also getting... I mean, that feels earlier, but I guess you can DI out of that, but I don't I don't think there's any way possible to DI, DI out of short hop fair. I think that's literally, uh, I think you're, that's literally inescapable. So, cool. But anyway, you want the berries and then the grenade throw. That's what I meant to do. The grenade throw to fair. I'm not hitting. I think I have an, I like I said, I think I have a good idea of the. Which I, oh boy. Yeah, grenade to grenade throw to fair, then center between center. If somebody's trying to, I don't know, shark you from between the platforms in the center, do that, and then. I don't know, does anything confirm it? Confirm it, and then uh, there's other ones that I uh, think they are hard, like the... That's harder to do. Up air to up tilt, or up air to up smash. Yeah. Yeah, I just... Then it's the, yeah, the grenade drop in the air. And just match the height of the other person, it's better to do it from a platform. Anyway. We, le we learned them all. We did them all. Not tonight, but I think we have. A, I think I have a good idea of what kills and what doesn't kill now. Definitely need to work on this. I'm not gonna bother with the ladders and stuff, but so I think uh, the next thing I need to do. I'm gonna put all the. I'm gonna put all these combo. All these combos I worked on, both off stream and on stream, in order. In in orders of like. Both how hard they are to do, um, what and what combo percents they start working at, and then whether or not they're just bread and butters or confirms. And then I'm going to uh, test 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 them all on uh, different weight classes, so I can know. And then so obviously, like I've said multiple times, is. I want to get my. I want to find the bread and butters that work the best on the most amount of most amount of weight classes. Uh, and then I think, and then uh, then just have a nice set of combos to work on every day, or not work on to practice every day. And then when I'm in bracket, when I'm in just in an actual format, I can be like, oh, I can actually hit this, not instead of doing crap like this. Yeah, it's hard. That wasn't it. Uh, okay. So anyway, that's it for the night. Um, be back tomorrow night with I don't know what I'm gonna do. Maybe I'll maybe I'll take a break from Smash tomorrow night. We'll see. Anyway, until next time, take it easy, everybody.